Hi everyone and welcome. In the previous video, we have covered that how to read holding registered data of your Modbus TCP IP device using JavaScript. So your JavaScript will act as a Modbus TCP client and then you can read the holding registered data of your Modbus TCP IP device or simulator. We have used this open more sim software to simulate Modbus TCP IP device, but you can use any simulator or you can use any physical Modbus TCP IP device. Now in this video, what we are going to see is we are going to see how to read input register data or input register value of your Modbus TCP IP device using JavaScript. Okay, so instead of holding register, which we have covered in the previous video, we are going to see input register data reading using JavaScript. So let's see how you can do that. So here is our folder, okay, in which you will have three files the package.json, package.log.json and read input register.js. Now to run this file, we have to install the necessary library. So for that, we have to install it. So how to install it? So you can install by using npm install. Okay, so it will install the library in your system. And once it is installed, you can now use this uh, read input register.js file okay so once you use it okay once you run that javascript file it will read the input register from this modbus tcp ip simulated device so how to run that file so you have to use node and then you have to use the file name read input register.js so it will read first 10 input register at interval of 10 second okay so this is the first reading now after 10 second it will read the second lot okay you can see now if you want to change the reading interval, then also you can change it. If you want to change the IP address port number of your Morbus TCP IP device, then also you can change it. Okay, so here is the code which I have used in this video. Okay, so here you have to specify the IP address of your Morbus TCP IP device. But right now, our simulator is running in my local system. So that's why I have provided localhost. Now the port number is 502 because our uh, Morbus simulator device is running on the port number 502. And here I have simulated 10 input register. So that's why I am using read input register and I have specified to read 10 input registers. Okay. And here you can see set interval is 10,000 milliseconds. So it is 10 seconds. If you want to read at every second, then you can remove one zero. You can save the file and uh, you can rerun the file. Okay. So now it will read at every second. Okay, you can see that. So this is how you can use this JavaScript code to read input register data of your Modbus TCP IP device. Okay, after that, you can display the data in the GUI, you can create your own application, whatever you want to do, you can do. But this is possible with the JavaScript. Okay, and if you want to get the code, then you can click here and you can get the code. Now in the next video, we will see how you can read coil status of your Morbus TCP IP device using JavaScript. Okay, so I hope this thing is clear that how you can use JavaScript to read the input register of your Morbus TCP IP device. So let's meet in the next video. Okay, till then, take care. Goodbye and thank you.